Hey, good morning guys. Jeff here with Dustless. Uh, coming at you with another Dustless Answers video. Uh, today's format is a little bit different as you can tell. We're not in the uh, R&D room. We are out here because we brought in an expert for this question today. Uh, we've got a quite a few questions about what this Buy American Act is. And so we brought in our product manager, Kristen, and she is going to tell us all about what the Buy American Act is. Well, Jeff, um, the Buy American Act was created in 1933 and signed by President Hoover, um, requiring the federal government to procure domestic goods and materials. The act protects business owners and laborers from non-domestic goods and materials. Um, the government is required for government purchases to contain 60% of American-made iron, steel, and manufactured goods unless it's under that micro-purchase threshold of $10,000 or there's no suitable product that can be found within the United States. Okay, okay. Um, in 2021, Joe Biden signed the Bipartisan Infrastructure Bill and also Executive Order 14005. And Executive Order 14005 kind of secures that Buy America Act um, it, to strengthen our economy and to support the American workforce. So 14005 um, will increase the domestic content of American-made products from 55% to 65% last year. Um, in two years, it'll be raised to 65%, and in by 2029, it'll be... 75 percent okay so each year it'll gradually go up a little bit more of yeah. how much the product has to be made here in the yeah. u.s they've strategically spaced it out so it gives companies time to get their products up to co you know up to that gotcha, 65 gotcha. and then 75 percent so so this is this is to drive anybody that's that's wanting to purchase um on a government contract type thing to buy american-made products yes Okay, so, so tell me, what is the difference or, or what's the similarities or what, what's the difference between Buy American Act and Made in the USA, Made in America? Well, Jeff, they're both overseen by different governing bodies. So Buy America is overseen by the Federal Acquisition Regulations and it is solely for the procurement of federal spending. So all those government dollars and stuff that is being put out into our economy from our government has to follow that Buy American Act requiring, currently requiring the 60% of American made content. Made in America is solely for advertising purposes, not to mislead the consumers of the content of where it comes from. Okay. And to be able to say made in America, your product needs to be all or virtually all made in the United States. Oh wow, okay. So there is a big difference between 60% in the Buy American and virtually everything in the made in the USA. Yeah. Yep. And the made in USC made in the USA is seen overseen by the Federal Trade Commission. Okay. So two totally different two totally different bo governing bodies. Okay. Okay. So tell me a little bit about this bipartisan infrastructure deal. What is, what is this? So last year, our government dumped trillions of dollars into the bipartisan infrastructure bill. There's an investment into our infrastructure, such as roads, bridges. Um, public transit, passenger freight rail, ETV infrastructure, electric buses, reconnecting communities, airports, portways, clean drinking water, high-speed internet, environmental remediation, and power infrastructure. And by doing that, it invests in our economy to create a more stable, resilient, and equitable economy. Okay, so any of those jobs like, like bridges or roads or anything like that, there's government money. Yeah, there's trillions of dollars of government money that's been put out to make those improvements. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah. Anything else with this, bi this uh, bipartisan uh, infrastructure bill? So the federal government is one of the major buyers of domestic or of goods and services. Um, and actually they're the largest single purchaser of consumer goods in the world. Mm -hmm. And being able to leverage that purchasing power they can help accelerate the market and accelerate innovation to support the future of our you support the future of U.S. workers and our economies and communities. They they are a big um, 
money spender, aren't they? The yes, U.S. government. Yes, they are. <laughs> so, yeah. well, very good. Anything else that uh, that we should let them know about the Buy American Act or anything like that? Well, with the spending of the infrastructure money, it gives us as Americans a way to invest in ourselves too. So when consumers, retailers, contractors um, buy, sell, and purchase American-made products, we are also supporting our economy. Even if it's not American-made money or American money from the federal government, we can all do our part to increase that independence that we need and stuff. I mean, COVID, the pandemic really showed us that we need to be more economic independent. That, that's very, very true. So buy American guys, buy American. We have quite a few products that qualify um, for the Buy American Act or fit under that content. We're always looking for ways to increase the content of our products. You know, we would love to be 100% American made. Um, it, as all companies know, it takes a while to get there and to be completely independent. But um, we do have several products that meet that, if not more, about 60% content. So we have our D1603, which is our dustless wet dry vac. We have our D1606, which is our HEPA wet dry vac. We have our H0302, which is our Dustroid 300. H0301, H0 which is our Dustroid 600. We have our H0901, which is our slurry topper. And then we also have our complete slurry system. So we have several shrouds that are also under that. So we have our dust buddy for flower work and cutting. We have our six inch dust cut, six inch cut buddy LT, our five inch cut buddy shroud, seven inch cut buddy shroud. We have our dust bowl for universal mounting kit, our five inch dust buddy shroud, our five inch dusty shroud, our seven inch dusty shroud, our four inch bit buddy, um, our saw buddy and we have our worm drive for circular saw our five inch dust buddy XP and our chip buddy and then we also have several of our accessories that are that all meet that, that. All meet that by America Act very Probably cool very cool for a list of our products that meet the buy American Act um, check our website uh, for those for those uh, products and uh, again, guys, uh, if you're not subscribed to our channel, make sure to click the subscribe button. Um, if you have a question about any of our products uh, or would like us to answer uh, any of your questions, put it in the comments down below so that uh, we can see those questions and we can uh, uh, answer those questions for you. Um, if you have any other questions, feel free to at any time give us a call. Uh, but uh, for now, that's it for today, and remember, make it dustless.